Welcome, welcome. So we are here to review the Gold Zero 150 Yeti solar um, panel. So, so uh, solar powered. What is that? Generator. <laughs> um, so as I opened it, it came with 80% charge. So it's good to go right now. We can use it as is. You can see this is. Uh, it has the one uh, AC uh, output output uh, plug. Has two USB USB uh, connectors. So you can use this and then um, use the port that has uh, split cables. Then you can charge more devices all at once. There is the 12 volt uh, output. And then um, this one uh, is something I think that you can still use for something else. While to charge it with the solar capabilities, you will need to have a cable that um, that would be compatible with this. And unfortunately, my solar panel isn't, so I'm gonna have to go to Canadian Tire or somewhere to look for um, a cable that would connect with this um, output. So I don't know how that will work. Anyway, uh, it's good as is. Um, if you charge it at home, it takes about six hours to completely charge it before we run um, the battery that it, the the charge that it comes with. It's uh, good for up to 15 charges for your portable phone, for your phones, lights, uh, laptop, and small gadgets. So. Um, Overall, uh, it's good for up to 14 on phones, up to 4 on laptops, small light, it, it can uh, go up to 6 charges, okay? So there you go. And then you just turn it on if you need it. And as you can see, when you, um, when you turn on the, the indicators, it will show you how much charge is left on the battery. So as it is, it came with 80% charge or maybe it was 100% charge, I don't know. You just lose the power um, as soon as you turn it. Okay, so there you go. Uh, I'm excited to use it and I'm so happy that I got this uh, portable generator. It's solar powered, but we just need to find a connector that would work with this, um, with this uh, cable. See you soon.